Hey church family, Pastor Heather here. I wanted to take some time today to check in with each of you. We have found ourselves again in stage five and this pandemic has been unexpected and ever-changing and full of ups and downs. So I hope you'll take some time today to check in with yourself, to be kind to yourself, and to celebrate all that you've done to overcome so far. I also wanted to remind you that we are still here. Your church family is still here, supporting you through all of this, figuring out how to navigate this with all of you, praying with you and for you. We are still here. When Austin returned to stage five, we had several discussions about what to do, how we could do no harm and fully support our community at the same time. We consulted with Dr. Tom Cavan, who continues to say that this stage five is different than before. So many people are fully vaccinated and boosted, and Omicron seems to be so much less severe than Delta and Alpha were before. And in other countries who have experienced an Omicron outbreak, their peak was fast and the decline was quick as well. This is all good news and reason to be hopeful. For this reason, we have decided to stay open for in-person worship for our 11 a.m. service only. For those of you who feel comfortable attending this service, we do ask that you physically distance yourselves from others who are attending. And please use the balcony. It is open and you can space out up there as well. And we will continue to require masks, but the re recommendation now is to switch from a cloth mask to a surgical mask or an N95 mask. And if you do not have one of those, we will have some available for you. We will also be leaving the doors to the sanctuary open at all times to allow for ventilation. So please dress accordingly. And we will not be offering childcare at this service and all Sunday school classes have moved back to online. Even with these precautions, it is the recommendation of Austin Public Health and Dr. Cabin that those who are unvaccinated or high risk remain at home. And that is, we still have a great option for you. Our online worship service will continue to premiere every Sunday at 11 a.m. And this will include hymns and prayers and a sermon. Some of you may opt for this and we absolutely understand. In fact, I will be choosing this option to keep our boys safe at home who are unvaccinated. So I'll see you online in worship at 11 a.m. Church, we are here for you. Whether you worship online or in person, we are here for you. Whether you are hopeful or frustrated, we are here for you as we all continue to do no harm and love our neighbor, we are here for you. God's grace and peace to you all.